This is the Dryden plan by Lifestyle Builders and Developers. It's a great first floor master bedroom plan that also includes a guest suite downstairs as well and a couple more bedrooms upstairs. So uh, great, uh, great plan. I uh, want you to come along with me and check out the inside. All right, here we are arriving uh, right inside the front door of our driving plan. And just to the right is a study uh, living room area. We've done this uh, as more of a study with the French uh, glass 15 light doors. And off to the left here is the dining room. You can see we've uh, done some trim work here, wainscoting. Uh, some custom paint colors and, and tray ceiling and crown molding here in this dining room. And just off of the family room here, and we're going to come back down uh, to this part of the house. I want you to see um, first, as we come down this way, this is a hallway back to the garage. That's the door into the garage and, and where the lights uh, on there and the door open. That's the laundry room. We've got some coat hooks we've put on the wall here for convenience of uh, storing coats, obviously, backpacks, uh, purses, shopping bags, whatever you need. Um, and then here we find we've got a full bath here. There's a vanity with uh, toilet and, and uh, tub shower combination here. And there's a door from the hallway as well as one here uh, that is going to lead uh, and give direct access from a first floor guest bedroom. So we'll take a quick look at that bedroom here. Window and closet. And back through that door into the bathroom that we just saw. So we'll take a trip back down the hall here past the dining room area and get a closer look at this family room. We've set this up with a fireplace here on this wall which is directly across from the kitchen area. So the kitchen opens directly into the family room. We've got a nice island set up here with a granite top overhang uh, done there for bar stools. Wall oven set up, stainless steel appliance package uh, with the cooktop and the hood vent. And then we've got the breakfast area, sunroom area here, you can see. And this house has got a covered deck. Take a quick look, this is really nice. The deck's got a, got a roof over it, covered. Uh, can be done, obviously, as a screened-in porch. Uh, we chose chosen to leave this one open air. Um, can be done as a, a, a deck without the roof over it. But uh, we've done this as the, the covered deck. And then we find off the left rear corner of the house the owner's bedroom. So we've got a first floor master suite here that we're in now and the first floor guest room with uh, direct access into its own bathroom one walk-in closet here second walk-in closet here and the owner's bathroom we've got a corner tub here We've done this with tile floor and surround and, and skirt here at the, the uh, tub. Split vanities. And a separate standalone shower done in ceramic tile finish. We'll take a quick look around upstairs next. Come on with me. All right, we're going to find ourselves here at the top of the stairs and one of the great features of this Dryden plan is it's got a tremendous amount of unfinished storage area. Very accessible, very easy to get to. Here's one of two, two areas. You can see how large that is for storing things. And we'll see the other one here in just a, just a moment. We've got two more bedrooms up here. Good size rooms for secondary bedrooms. 
separated here by a bath, a full bath up here. As you can see, there's the other one. And here, we've got a, a really nice loft area. We've uh, put some recessed cans in this loft up here. You can see how open this is. Great recreational loft, bonus room area. And the other unfinished storage area here in this plan is access off of this bedroom. You can see how large this is. Just a lot of space in this plan to store things, seasonal things that you don't use all the time. This is the Dryden Plan by Lifestyle Builders and Developers.